Good morning, I'm Christy Duffy for Smart Trend News. Today is Friday, July 30th, and this is your early morning market snapshot. At this hour, U.S. equity futures are trading lower overseas. The Asian markets fell while the European markets are down. The Department of Justice filed a complaint under the False Claims Act against Oracle Corporation and Oracle America, alleging that Oracle defrauded the U.S. on a General Services Administration software contract that was in effect from 1998 to 2006 and involved hundreds of millions of dollars in sales. The Walt Disney Company announced the sale of Miramax Films to Filmyard Holdings for over $660 million, subject to certain adjustments. And Wright Express is to acquire Australian assets of retail decision for $318 million. Dunn & Bradstreet sold its North America self-awareness solutions business for $100 million. And McAfee announced that it entered into a definitive agreement to acquire privately owned 10Cube, the provider of the Wave Secure mobile security service. Stanley Black & Decker announced it acquired CRC Evans International for $445 million in cash from a group of investors led by private equity firm Natural Gas Partners. The pantry signed a fuel supply agreement with Marathon Petroleum Company, a Marathon oil subsidiary, to supply fuel to more than 600 pantry locations with a joint branding relationship at approximately 285 of these sites. Universal Truckload CEO Don Cochran sees the trucking business recovering. And Charles River Laboratories announced that it mutually agreed with Woozy Pharmatech to terminate their previously announced acquisition agreement. I'm Christy Duffy for Smart Trend News. For more news and market analysis, make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel. That's Trade the Trend. Also visit our website, tradethetrend.com, for more headlines.